Rover. Red Rover unto Nate Miller. Especially when he's got his, all his buddies behind him 
against one guy. But folks, I don't know if that's the answer either. You know, if you kind of let some folks just handle it. Kids, handle it. Kids, learn how to deal with it. You can get a lot, folks that are a lot tougher, a lot rougher. You're banning this, banning that. Well, some of the things when you're playing Red Rover, you learn, you learn strategy. You learn how to find the weak links. You learn how to break through it. You know, and the neat thing about that game is once it's over, and everybody's got to one side or the other, you know what you do? <coughs> you line them up and you do it again. <laughs> and that's the neat thing about the, a game. And that's the thing as well, like in, in this world. Everybody's going in blogs and everything's, everything's getting rougher and rougher, but nobody's really holding on to hands and lining up. Facing each other clearly and saying, Red Rover, Red Rover, you send Hillary over. Red Rover, Red Rover, send Sarah over. You know, now we're just th throwing out bombs and blogs and internet and stuff. But there's something about grabbing that hand and holding on. And challenging that folk, that, that, that girl, that guy to come on over, whether it's in politics, whether it's in religion, whatever it is. But it's facing your opponent and giving it all you got. Oh, that was the other thing. If you don't break through that line, then you stay on that side. But then you grab that hand. And you build that line, and you now you, you switch sides, and now you're stronger. Because somebody else is going to be coming over. Folks, that's one of those beauties of the Red Rover. That's what we need to get that whole thing back in, in, our, in our mentality. So when we're speaking from our passions, we can go ahead and break that line. Or join that other side. So... If you're ready, y'all take your stand, you grab a hand, because y'all get ready. Because right now, Red Rover, Red Rover, you got Anthony coming on over. <laughs>